shouldn't be standing with a heart that's so heavy I shouldn't be up with all the weight that I carry Don't know if it's right, but I'm sticking with you You're my only vice, I'm dependent on you Love's for the wicked, I know this shit too well I talk, you don't listen, still I'm under your spell I think I'm addicted to feeling bad as hell I can just let you go Hello guys, I'm very excited about this because I don't think I've ever ate out of five guys. I did have their fries a long time ago, like 20 years ago. I think I think if they've been here 20 years, I think it's been about 20 years. Oh. I usually don't lie on Fridays. I didn't know five guys was over well, 20 whenever, years ago. It's been a long time ago, <laughs> whatever. Okay, it's been a long time, okay. Maybe 18 years, but uh, they, don't, they don't do medium rare, or rare. they do it all well done, uh, but uh, they have free, free peanuts. I don't supposed to have peanuts, but they do have the free peanuts. Um, and you saw the big bag of fries. They have a freaking huge bag of fries uh, for like two to three people. That's the regular size right here. Uh, yeah, that's the regular. I think the small, she said one to two. One to two people. Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, and what else I was going to, oh, all the sauces, like everything's free. All the toppings are free, but we got A1 sauce and hot sauce inside. Go ahead. No, we didn't order it, but I do like those. <laughs> uh, we didn't get a milkshake. <laughs> she actually came outside like, I thought it was a complimentary milkshake. Uh, but uh, uh, I'll get a milkshake next time. But we got all the sodas in there. If you saw, they have all the Fanta and all the- Yeah, they the have one sodas. of the, the touch screen one where you pick the drink and then you can add the different flavors. So it's one of those touch kiosks drink machine things i like mellow yellow but then they got peach grape lemonade all kind of yeah. orange uh, and uh i got a bacon cheese this is a bacon cheeseburger the second yeah, one we the second one. that was yours uh, well, we're gonna do the hot dog first it's a kosher all beef hot dog um and we got grilled onions and cheese and mustard i think and mustard uh, so that one is uh cheese dog 6.59 the fries were 4.89 the bacon cheeseburger was 10.33, and the cheeseburger was 9.13 or 9.19, so 10.99. So it's 10.99. Uh, the print, the print on here is messed up. I couldn't see the rest of that. Okay. Well, I think I said all the prices, and all the total with tax is 39.65 before tax, 36 dollars and four cents. And I did get a knife this time. Did I text you to get? Oh, I didn't get the text. Oh. Oh. Well, Kyle, uh, the hitman hall, um, was supposed to call me earlier and he just, he was just him calling me now. Um, yeah. With your phone yeah. on, not on salad. Yeah. So thanks Kyle. He's probably watching this video. He watches all my videos now. Mm -hmm. We're going to do, we might be doing a hamburger challenge because his buddy kind of reversed on his, because he said there was all of them that I did in his area, except one. He, there's a team challenge. Oh, okay. Okay. But this is the hot dog. I just cut it so you can see the cross section. But it's cheese, onions, and mustard, like we said. 
but I've never had a hot dog from here. Good enough for the price. No, that hot dog six dollars. If I, then it's not. I want to say three fifty. Three fifty. Okay, it's three fifty. But it tastes great though. Half of what? Yeah. It's a good quality hot dog. It's thick. You know, most hot dogs you buy in is really. Sounds girthy. Yeah. Well, that is not as firm. That's what I guess that's the word I'm looking for. Like it's a bounces I'm back. Because I was going to say like something. It bounces back. And it, oh, you're going to say something, but it got twisted? Yeah. Hot dogs are pretty good. They taste kind of like kind of like when you go to a fair and get like, you know how you want to want fair food and you go and get their hot dogs with the grilled onions and all food. that other stuff? I want stuff. fair. I want great food. <laughs> Uh, do you want to try the fries? Or are you still on the hot dog? Sorry, I don't eat as fast as you. Maybe I didn't get a lot of season on that one. I do I, I do taste it on my fingers though. Yeah, it's coming. Then we got the Cajun fries. Cajun it's fries. a little just a hint, like a little spicy. It's a place to park right in front of us. I guess. Okay. Uh, the fries are oh they hand make the fries every pick like, it over oil. that's what I wanted to say oh sorry to cut you off I was going to forget all of it's the peanut oil and if you're allergic to peanuts actually people are allergic to fat so they're not oil, they're not allergic to the fat so the peanut oil they're not allergic to yeah because Daryl is allergic to peanuts but he but can he eat Chick-fil-A yeah uh -huh. But I thought, is, is that the same case as for people with severe peanut allergies? Like I don't want to get off into that. I don't, don't know. Don't you go out there eating nothing with peanut yeah, oil don't, and don't listen to me. you're allergic. Don't do That's it. That's what I thought. I read it online, so it had to be true. I like their fries. This is no cholesterol. So there's no, no cholesterol. No cholesterol and peanut oil? I, I don't know. Maybe that's why That's it's so expensive. The fries, did I see how much the fries we have? 4 dollars That's not a bad price for those fries. Yeah, All those they fries. give you the cup of fries and yeah. they also just so put instead of giving another you a, cup of it oops. in the bottom of the bag. Yeah, instead of giving you like a bigger cup, they just put one cup and then fill the bag up. Yeah, just fill up. the bag up. Oh. They're, really nice. They're really nice in there too. Do not go to Five Guys and order a large fry. Unless you got eight Don't people. Don't do it. I thought they had bottomless fries at one time. That no, they just Robin. give you so many. That's Red Robin with the Okay, that's fries. where I might have been 20 years ago. You don't think they have Red Robin in? I don't know. They have Blue Jay? Blue, I'm Blue not going to say you lying. I bet not. Bet not. Okay, now we can move on to the burger even though. You want to finish it? Go ahead. No. We can wait all day. My videos are usually an hour long. No. I'm going to be full by the time I get to okay, my burger. yours is... 9.19 and mine's 10.99. Yeah, that bacon costs a lot. That uh, bacon, yeah, it costs a dollar eighty-ish. Okay. <laughs> Do I want to cut mine in half? So I'm already saying. Let me see how much bacon's on there. Oh, it's a lot of bacon on there. It is. It, they did put a nice amount of bacon on there. Do I gotta wait for you. You don't have to. And we got A1 sauce and hot sauce that I, I wanted to wait to see about the flavor on it first. Let's see what kind of hot sauce they have. I'm trying to. Oh, is this Frank's? It smells different. Oh, I sm you don't have to put it in my face. I smell it. <laughs> but this is the cross cut of my burger. I got a cheeseburger all the way. But I think he told you that already. Yep, that's grilled onions, grilled mushrooms, tomatoes, pickles. Mayo. Mayo, mustard, ketchup, lettuce. So all, all, all that. It's good. It does remind me a little of steak and shake. Just a little, but it's more meatier. It's like you get yeah, a lot meaty more meat. Yeah, meaty steak and yeah. 
I agree with you with it. What? Pitch me. Mm. No. Beard meets food. M E A T, not M E E T. Beard meets food. So this is the third place to go. It's five guys. But it's some food spots in Memphis that burgers are like this, but not as expensive. Like, yeah. like uh, the they're, uh, like the queen. corner stores and stuff. Oh, okay. Now what you call? Okay, the corner stores. Yeah. We just say Abraham places. But they're not even Arabs out there. Like, you know, if you, if you say Arab, that's like cursing them out if they're from somewhere else. Oh. Yeah. But they always say Arab. I don't know why. I say Israel or something. Well, we have more foreigners where we're at, though, like on the corners. Mm hmm. The burgers are pretty good. I was telling him, it's, I don't think I've ever, I may have had five guys once, but. It's been so many years ago, I don't remember. I'm not even going to say it's not worth it. I think $11 is pretty expensive for a burger, but if I do Man, pay $11 for, for a burger, burger only. if I do pay $11 for a burger, I would come here for $11, is all I can say. You get free mouth, free mouth service. But here. You get free mouth service? Yeah, you just hook okay. me up. Thank you. I'll leave you that one. Nothing to say? Nope. Hey, y'all doing? Hey. Good, how are you? Right. Southern hospitality. Yep, I haven't talked. <laughs> I'll leave. Oh. I don't know. To me, nine dollars is kind of cheap for a burger, even though it's cheap a double cheap. Steep. I mean, try to kind of cheap. I mean, steep. Okay. Um, Cause you even said cheap. though I didn't, I didn't mean to. Cause I had to point that out. <laughs> I, I'm glad you did. Thank you. Go ahead. I'm sorry. But even though it's a double patty burger, that's still that's a lot for a burger. I understand the prices of beef are probably up or something. I don't come here, so I don't know well, if the, the gas. prices are. It's the gas shortage now. That's what they're going to blame it on. Like, lumber should be like $80 a board now. But yeah, so it's a pretty to, good pretty good burger. Well, like I said, it is steep, but if I was to go anywhere and all the burgers that size was that price, I would come here to get that burger. Does that, does that, does that make any sense? Yeah, if you had to choose if all of them were the same price, yeah. I just said that. I was just reiterating what you said, smart. Well, guys, if you like something from here, your best, like what kind of toppings you like, what, what is your go-to? Yeah, what's your go-to combination? Let us know in comments. And if you haven't been here before and you go there, write a new comment and uh, let us know how you liked it. Want to say something before we go? No, but. I don't know. Go ahead. No. Okay. Well, we'll I'll definitely come back here. Try some what? Other stuff. I'll try some other stuff to see, like a milkshake at least. Maybe a food challenge with a lemon. I'm just surprised call. you said you'll come back because of the price of stuff. Well, I gotta try other stuff too, though. I'm doing it for, you know, for these guys. I wouldn't normally spend no money on food, but I'm doing it, you know, for those guys. Those guys right there. But uh, we're gonna get off here. Hopefully the wind's not blowing too much. It's just blowing just a little bit, but. Yeah, it's not bad. But it, it does feel nice outside today. But yeah, like you said, go to Five Guys if you're out and you can, because everything is made fresh to order. The buns are really fresh. The veggies on the burger, everything's pretty fresh. It's good. Glad you said that, because we didn't need to say nothing about that. Yeah, these buns are really, really soft. Mm -hmm. And you can buy bags of potatoes in there, I think. Really? I think so. There's big I bags. I mean, I saw the bags. Oh, that's just your storage. They put it right there. Oh, yeah, it is specialty. They got bags specially selected for our french fries. Okay. 
Well, I'm gonna eat the rest of these fries. Yes, and, he uh, is. And I'm, yeah, the seasoning, I'm just getting down in that bag. It's, it's really good. I'm gonna try to finish my burger. Okay, well. I don't eat as much as he does. Before I go though, I'm gonna say the best bargain on this table is the fries. Yeah. Hands down. Hands down. And I think that's Frank's. I'm not a fan of Frank's. Sorry, I don't put that on everything. Well, see you guys later and um, thanks for watching. Till next time. And I thought something was on me. You dropped a fry on my leg. They was about to see me cut up. Okay, well, let's just cut off here before you cut up. Go post stop recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visited my website yet, um, the, the address is www.dougarbagedisposalstore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, uh, fill that out, and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here, um, and you'll get a weekly newsletter. So uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you, so I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss, and have a great day unless you meet other plans.